show you must have heard about Chicago, you must have heard about uh, Toronto certificate and how they claim he bought this and that, how he said he worked with uh, Deloitte. You know, we've heard several of these things about him. They believe that he didn't go to school, but, you know, we cannot say Bola Betty who did not attend school. Maybe he didn't finish. I don't know. But with all of this, a video popped up and a man decided to tell us about Bola Met. You know, his name is Tunde Badijo. He said, Bola is my childhood friend. We have gone a long way in America. We attended the same university. When he was in the accounting department, I was in mathematics. At one point, he ran for the position of president of the accounting department. There were three vying for the position. Tinubu, a person called Jide, and the other person, and he eventually won the election. That was where he started picking interest in politics. Before we ever went to America. So I happened that we went to the same university. Where he was in the accounting department, I was in the mathematics department. So at one point, he ran for the president, uh, president of the accounting society of the university. Two guys bubbled up as finalists. It was himself and more or less intelligent young man called GD. I don't know if I saw them. He eventually won. He eventually won that election. Ah, what I think is the extent of him into politics. Now, you see, like I said, people have asked for pictures. They want to see childhood pictures. They want to see this and that. Does he have it? Or it does not have it. You see, these are the questions. Now, this man went on to say that every other day he is not always at home, but on Sundays we will all always visit him in his house. Then he was always watching strategy shows like Chicago politics, football, basketball, and he claimed that this was Bola Messinubu's way of preparing himself for the future. How true are this? Of course, you cannot say, oh. This is not true because there are no childhood pictures. We can't say so. They might have pictures. They might not have pictures. But I mean, Tunubu might have pictures and choose not to put out pictures as well of showing that he went to this school, he did this and that. He might decide not to do this. But people are like, you know, we need to see. We want to be sure. But are pictures, evidences or evidence that you go, you attend a school? I don't think really. You might attend the school but not finish. Certificate that can be verified is what people want to see. And when I say certificate, don't forget that people can also buy certificate. Every every institution has its own price. Not all institutions will buy, collect money. Imagine a university is giving $2 million, $3 million or $5 million for them to run your certificate. Some might accept and they might do this. So people are saying you should post pictures. Stop all of this talk. Post group pics. Don't look for one person to come out blabbing. Someone who will say, yes, we both went for this. We went for that. He was this. He was that. He was part of this university. He attended Chicago University. Did this. They say they don't want to hear any of this. They say post pictures. Group picture. Something to show, to prove that you really went to the school. And... Since he wants to be president of Nigeria, Bola Metunubu can just do this at this time or maybe at the final point. You know, when people kind of are more louder about it, Bola Metunubu can just begin to bring out pictures, 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 pictures to shut people's mouth. But is he going to do it? That is the bone of contention. That is what people actually worried about like is this guy this dude this baller about to know is he really going to do this thing is he going to eventually put out pictures of himself and his classmate cosmate is he going to do this or is he just going to continue telling us that i went to i went to i went to when maybe he never did that's it but like he said he said Social media gives him high blood pressure. He gets angry. And who knows? Maybe, you know, it's really bothering him. But then if things are bothering you, why don't you face it head on? 
People want to know about your qualification. If you have it or you don't have it. Did you finish or you didn't finish? People want to know about these things. Even if you hide your source of money. At least your education. But then, you know, considering that you, 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 you listening, you might say, no, you are not part of it. Could support Buhari not thinking or minding his educational qualification. He became your president and he brought you to where you are. If you could, why are you clamoring, crying over Bola Ahmed Tunubu? That's it. You shouldn't. You should accept that you are bringing in people who somehow do not have integrity. They cannot produce their certificates. They say they worked here. No proof. They say this and that. But I don't want you to be swayed or be deceived by certain narratives. Do not forget that it is the same media, social media, that was used to kick out Ebele Jonathan. Not because he is good. They brought in another person who is so worse. And that person is your president. They made use of social media. They told you that he doesn't have any house. Only one house with cow. He never stole. He's a Muslim. Very dedicated. The front of his head is black with prayers. Praying to God. He was a very strict military man. They said all sorts. And eventually. This is the Buari now. They said no this is not Buari. The Buari that they know in those days. is because at that time it's like it wasn't affecting you. But now we've come to a point. We are wiser. We're able to see better. We're able to understand things deeper. That is why you feel that Buhari is not the right person. And because of the so-called democracy, that's why people are saying Buhari is not the right person. If this was military era, would you have said Buhari is not a good person? You will know he's not good, but there's nothing you cannot you can do about it. So, guys, what are your thoughts as regards this? Do you think we should begin to tag Bolame Tunubu? Let us make this loud. Like, Bolame Tunubu, release your certificate once and for all so that this accusation, counter-accusation, you know, particularly for your health that you say they are giving you high blood pressure, you get hungry and all of that. For all of this is to rest, for everything to come down to normal. Why don't you just show them this? At least your certificate, not necessarily group pictures. Anyone that wants to verify it, they can go ahead. Don't forget to subscribe if you have not done so. The renovation and is very important. Please do tap on it.